everyone, I'm back and um, I'm sorry I have been gone. I have really no excuse for why I was gone. I was just kind of lazy, you could say. But I'm back and I'm actually going to make videos on like the times that I said, oh, I'm going to make more videos, but I'm actually going to make more videos. I just want you guys to request more and I'll do the request and I hope you guys enjoy. I'm going to be doing a uh, like kind of a collective haul, not really, just like a mini haul of the things I've gotten since I've been gone and it's really that, not that much. I really didn't pay for most of it because they were like samples and stuff but there are some things that I did pay for. So yeah, here we go. First I got the oil free acne wash pink grapefruit facial cleanser and this is by Neutrogena and it's and it's just like this and I got this because my friend was raving about it but um this is not what I use for my facial stuff but it's a really good facial um, um cleanser and it's really good and it smells delish then I got the Clinique um technically four step thing it comes with um the Clinique Dr Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel with Pump. And this is for um, oily skin, but I don't know why she gave me this. It, like, I think she said it works better for my skin. How it is, but I'll show you how it is. It's just like this. It's like, I've been using this and it's like amazing. And it like makes your skin feel fresh. And so, <clears throat> if you guys have oily skin this is for you but yeah hopefully you guys can do that pretty sure you guys can wrong way hmm okay that was that and then I got the um, Clinique Liquid Facial Soap, and this is step one. And this looks like this, and it's and it's a mild for dry combination, so it's step two. Then got the facial wash, and I just washed my face, and it's the Clinique Rinse Off Foaming Cleanser. And then I got the big clarifying tone, not toner. Clarifying lotion for dry combination. It's huge. And, and then it came with that little bag. So I love this and it's been making my skin amazing. And I've been using it day and night. And then I got this from the Dollar Tree. Um it's the our ver it's our version of Hello Kitty for Women by Hello Kitty. And it's the Jordic Woman. And it's only a dollar and you get two point low ounces and it's a pretty big bottle and it's really nice for being at the dollar store it's a really nice bottle it smells so good then I got some stuff from my mom she gave me the stuff because it didn't work for her so first she gave me the sheer cover uh, face palette but it has a, blu a blush a lip gloss and eyeshadow so Sorry if you hear that ringing. It's my home phone, but it's probably a telemarketer. This is like so hard to open. So, this is how it's set up. So, this is the blush. And then there's two eyeshadow thingies. And then there's the lip gloss. I I use the brown color because it's kind of matte. It has only like a tiny sparkle. Like the brown. That color for my brows. But I'm trying to find a really good um brows. Um brows. What am I trying to say here? Brow pencil that's my color for my eyebrows. But this is what I use. Um, then I got the Clinique, um, eyeshadow trio. Uh, 
These are like really hard to open. Okay, so it has a mirror, and um, this is the eyelid color. Um, this is the crease, and then the blackish color is the liner, and then this is the um, what you would call it, blush. Sorry, brain fart. Um, and it comes with a cute little, sorry, cute little brush. Um, the reason why I'm kind of rushing is because my last video was 16 minutes and I don't want this 16 minutes to be 16 minutes. Um, I, I bought this True Match L'Oreal and it's a concealer and it's, um, in the cool and it's, I think it goes concealed. I'm trying to put it in the middle because that's how my camera picks up and auto focuses. Uh, and it just looks like this. And I'll swatch it. This looks like that. I know it's a lot, but it blends in really nicely, but I'm like way tanner than it. Um, then I got the matching True Match Super Blendable Powder, and I use this as a setting powder instead of like an actual powder. It works really well. It's like a compact, it's like that color, it's an alabaster. I don't know if I'm saying that wrong, but it comes with me, and a little sponge, and it's like cute for your purse. So then, let me get this thing out. Mine is one thing in this bag. It's all samples. Um, I got this bag from a Clinique, and I also got a bigger one, but I gave that to my friend because I already have a Clinique makeup bag. And she needed a bigger makeup bag, so I thought it'd be nice, and I gave it to her. And we all got samples, too. So we went to Sephora, and we got um, some samples. I got most samples. My mom actually bought some stuff. I got the Taylor Swift Wonderstruck Perfume. It just looks like that. I'll pull it out. It smells. I love Taylor Swift, and her perfume is the best. Then I have the Makeup Forever HD Foundation I One Fifteen, and my mom gave this to me a while ago, and you can tell I've been using it. And I I haven't showed it in a video, so I just, I just decided to show it. So I got this a long time ago. Then. I got the Urban Decay Complexion Primer Potion. Pull all these out. Go really fast. So this is just what it looks like. It's just like a white color. Sorry for my looking down a lot. Um, this is the Make It Forever Ishi Primer Original. Then I got the Benefit Total Moisture Facial Cream. These ladies at Sephora were really nice and they didn't like, they're like, oh, we'll give you a sample of that. So they were really nice. Then I have the um, L'Oreal Carbon Black Telescopic Eyeliner, well, liquid eyeliner. The brush is just like, you can't see. There. And it makes it a noise. You guys can't hear that. Then I also got a new sample of the Makeup Forever HD Foundation because I was thinking about buying it. But now I'm like really torn between um because there's another foundation I want to try from Sephora and that's NARS Sheer Glow. Because I thought it would like bring hydration, but I'm, I tried it on, but I also had foundation under the Sheer Glow, so maybe that's why it made me look it made my face kind of look heavy. Um, cause I was trying out a lot of foundations on my face and that's probably why it looked really heavy. So I want to get, go back there and get a sample, sample of this NARS Sheer Glow and just like l l try it on the, alone. So like then, cause I also want to get, um, the Clinique Super Balance, um, foundation cause the, the lady at the Clinique place tried it on me. And I looked really natural and stuff and like really good. So 
I have another one, and this will last me a while. Then I got the Benefit Triple Performing Facial Illusion. Then I got three samples from Plenty. I got the 7 Day Scrub. Then I got my foundation. I got the Super Balance Foundation. This should last me a while too. Um, and then I got Super 25. This is like, you could, it's like SPF and you can wear it under your foundation or just wear it alone if you're not really up to doing foundation. So it's really nice. So comment below um, what foundation I should get because um, I'm really deciding on getting the Makeup Forever but I really like the Clinique so I don't know what to do. Um, but Makeup Forever is really expensive and Clinique is more cheaper since I'm only like 14. And um, so you guys should let me know if I sh what foundation I should get out of the three. Um, the Clinique Super Balance, the Makeup Forever HD Foundation, or the NARS Sheer Glow. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this, um, collective mini haul. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Please subscribe, thumbs up, and comment request. Thanks, bye.